What is up everybody? Today we're going to be going to one of my favorite catfish spots to target some monster catfish. So let's get out there. Alright guys, so I just got out here and I got my two big rods out right now. And uh, they both have chicken hearts on them. And uh, what we're going to do is we're actually going to try to catch some bait. Um, I'm going to be trying to put some uh, live, live or cut uh, brim on one of these rods. Um, so what we're going to do is, I'm going to start out with this little lure. Uh, this is what I was using in one of my previous videos for some creek fish. But uh, anyway, we're just going to cast it down here and see if we can get anything on it. Uh, if not, I do have some live worms we can throw on here and see what, see what we can get. Alright guys, so the plastic worm was not working. So what we're going to try is the live worm, which would probably do better. Let's see what happens. Now, sometimes they, they just might not be here. That's why I didn't want to rely on just catching bait because I've come here before and like fished here all day. Can't, can't catch bait. So that's why I got the chicken hearts, which they work fairly good. Oh, got one, got one, there we go. First bait of the day, just a really small panfish. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 look at this. Oh, nice. Well, that was unexpected. <laughs> so that's this one. That's, this is what we want for bait. <laughs> Nice sized brim. There we go. That is exactly what we want, right size. There we go, second fish of the day. Very nice brim. Alright, got another bait on there. And we're gonna make it happen. I'm hoping those people leave in a while so we can go and set up there for the rest of the day. I don't really like fishing on the bridge necessarily um, just because there's a lot of snags and stuff and and I have rod holders and stuff that would just be better for what we're trying to do not just leaning them against the pier itself because they could go in I don't want that that's why I have the drag super lo loose on them hey another one a little bit smaller Nice size though, for what we need it for. There we go. Whoa, hang on, this is different. This is a, sh a shiner. Look at the size of that. <laughs> this is what I used to, oh no, no, no. This is what I used for bait on uh, Lake Lanier. That's crazy, <laughs> the size of that thing. <laughs> oh, caught something different. I think. Oh yeah, I got it. Check this out, this is a crappie. I haven't caught a crappie in years. Huh. I caught him on a on um I caught him on a worm, which is really strange because crappy typically don't do that. <laughs> well, look at that. There's a nice crappie. We're actually gonna keep him for bait. But that's the first crappie in forever. <laughs> that's interesting because you typically don't see crappie going after worms. All right, guys. So uh, since catching that crappie, I wasn't able to catch any more panfish slash bait fish. So uh, right now, I'm gonna take a break. Um, I mean, I have enough bait probably for the rest of the day. Um, I just want to have a little bit extra. But uh, anyway, we have our three rods out over there, um, and you know, the rest of the day we'll just be chilling, waiting for a catfish, hopefully. Um, if not, this will just be a panfish video, and this is probably nearing the end of it, uh, unfortunately. Uh, but anyway, right now I'm about to eat some lunch and uh, hopefully get a fish in a little bit. Um, after I eat, I'm going to rebait some of these hooks and uh, go from there. So we'll see what happens. 
make sure to go and check out my merch. I have a link in the description.